How's it going guys? It's Ethan Preston, your host here at Preston Outdoors. In today's video, I want to talk to you guys about two different rods here that I've used over the years and do a little rod comparison video for you. talk to you about the Wright McGill Skeet Reese rod and obviously this is the uh, 7.2 jig and slash worm rod a Wright McGill the Skeet Reese uh, signature series um, I picked these up oh my gosh it's been I started using these Skeet Reese rods I um, was looking for a, a low price high quality rod what got me on these ones was this thing they call S-curve technology to where they limit the overall weight of the rod but also be able to give you a very very um, sensitive rod in that and that's what I what I found in, in this rod. I was very very happy with the sensitivity in it and the strength um, you know like I said it's a 7.3 or 7.2 excuse me um, but it's got a lot, of, a lot of heft in it. The only thing I would say that I knocked on these rods when I was using them is that the the rod from the reel seat out is very very heavy as you can tell it, it really falls down I actually put uh, weighted balancing caps on the end of these which were pretty pretty good I use them on mostly any of my rods that I use today just to increase the sensitivity but I mean it would it was it was a lot lot of stress on my wrist to where you're flipping out there with a jig and you're bouncing like this a lot, you know. At least how I work a work a jig in shallow water, I'm hopping and skipping and swimming it quite a bit, to where it's getting a lot of stress on my my wrist. But otherwise, I really really fell in love with these these rods. So this was this was my favorite favorite rod for the last oh like I said how many years I've had these at least four or five. I mean if I if I, I love fishing a jig for for largemouth and smallmouth. So that was, this is the rod I picked up if I was going fun fishing, you know, pre-fishing for a tournament, something like that. This is the rod that I really, really looked to. But that was all the way until this, uh, this past summer, the summer of 2017. I didn't think I'd ever switch using these rods and then reels and stuff like that. But this next rod even blew me out of the water even more to where I, I don't even use this rod anymore. And that would be this rod. This is a Cast King 7-1 Perigee 2 rod. It's a medium heavy. They came out with their uh, Perigee 2 rods later later last summer. Um, I picked up I picked up like three or four just to test them out. Some spinning rods, some bait casting rods, everything like that. And I was like, well, I need a medium heavy. I want I want to compare my favorite rod, this one right here, the Skeet Reese rod, the jig rod, to something like this to where I can um, fish a jig with also. And boy, was I blown out of the water. This rod is it's labeled as medium heavy but the way how sensitive it is and how I wouldn't say limber but it's you got way more sensitivity and just a little bit more give than what you get from your you know normal stock medium heavy um, medium heavy bait casting rods. So the Cast King Perigee 2 rod has a technology trademarked by Cast King it's called Cast Flex technology and it's it's a little bit above my understanding oh, um, watching videos and talking to people that are really really deep into side building these rods is that it's a different way that they have woven the components together around the rod blank which in turn does this increase the strength of the rod but also decreases the weight of the rod so I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you learned something again we're approaching 1000 subscribers on my youtube channel I think we're last I looked five or six um, subscribers away. Once we get to a thousand, there'll be a big giveaway, like I told you uh, last year. My goal was to reach a thousand by the end of December. We're a little over halfway through um, 
January here, so we're a little bit behind, but that's all right. It would just, just be awesome to reach that reach that goal that I've had set for this year. Um, we're going to be doing a big giveaway as well, so we can get there. I want to thank you guys for watching. Hope you learned something. This is just a little comparison video that in here in the off season, when I'm not uh, off season, I should say, from the open water season, um, do a little comparison. Just letting you guys know some of the uh, the gear and stuff that I've I've used, I've tested. Um, I really like some of this stuff, and I you know it takes a lot for me to switch over and stuff like that. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Haven't already? I mentioned this before. Instagram page is over 500 um, followers as well. That's awesome. I share a lot of my pictures and stuff in between videos there as well. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Tune in next time. Preston Outdoors.